What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Ricky Ricky. Your boy, Ricky Ricky, is live, live with you guys. Today is May 28, 2021. And today I want to talk to you guys about the Lakers versus the Phoenix Suns. Game three, my thoughts, my opinions. Uh, so I was lucky and fortunate enough to finally finish all my school stuff and been able to watch game one game two game three of the lakers versus phoenix now let me tell you game one whoo phoenix i think they had to come out and beat the lakers you know they had something to prove to themselves that they deserve to be here they came out uh it was a return for the phoenix suns to once again um be a part of the playoffs be a part of the playoff run you know last year uh, 2020 we were dealing with the pandemic with the COVID-19 the virus everything and the NBA superstars basketball teams were heading to Orlando to play in this thing called the bubble where they had to get tested they had to be you know no signs of COVID-19 no signs of being sick or symptoms in order to be playing in the bubble phoenix were one of the teams that joined everybody in orlando and were the was the only team to go eight and zero in that little tournament before the playoffs now as soon as the playoffs started the things you know things started to go down teams started facing each other and the lakers won the crown and became the 2020 nba champs now this year <clears throat> the phoenix suns were you know battling it out with the rest of the West. The Lakers were, for the most part of the season, the number one seed. Then LeBron got injured. Anthony Davis got injured. Uh, Shooter was out for a couple weeks. And the Lakers dropped. They dropped to the number seven seed. Wasn't looking too good a couple weeks ago. The Lakers were looking like they were so close to being out of the playoffs. You know, when they had that tournament, they had to play in this new tournament this new NBA tournament where they have the seventh seed go against the eighth seed and then have the loser will play against the ninth seed in order to win that eighth spot or, you know, keep that seventh seed depending on the results. The results was that the Lakers defeated the Warriors by three points to 103 to 100. That meant the Lakers got to keep their seventh seed and go against the Phoenix Suns where we're at right now. As for the Warriors, they had to go against Memphis Grizzlies and they lost and now the Warriors are not a part of the playoffs the Memphis is they're playing against I can't recall right now who they're playing against but we're talking about the Lakers and the Phoenix Suns right now I know I'm getting all over the place because I have a lot to say there's a lot to talk about so right now I just want to keep the Lakers to Phoenix uh, I got to see game one Phoenix like I said came out they won that game good for them uh, game two uh, the Lakers got things done they came out anthony davis had a bad game one came back on game two and you know showed everybody that he is gonna bounce back after having that bad game lebron and anthony davis thanks to them like pulling through at the end um they shut it down and we got the win in game three uh we were back at staples center back with fans in la which was nice and we got our first playoff win since 2012 that's crazy that was a long time ago that the lakers got a playoff win you know the lakers have been in a dry spell they've been out of the playoffs for some time now so it was nice to get the lakers back in playoff basketball and not only getting back to the playoffs but winning uh last year obviously they would have had some wins again but they didn't play at staples center they played in orlando um but yeah, LeBron, Anthony Davis came through last night, got the Lakers their first win since 2012 at Staples Center with fans in attendance. And yeah, you know, it looked pretty close. It looked like it was gonna be another close game. Game quarter one and quarter two were looking very close. I think they were at 33 to 33 at one point. Next thing you know, things got going. They got Anthony Davis going, LeBron got going, Schroeder got going. And next thing I know, the rest was history. Phoenix Suns were left behind an afterthought and just based on what I've seen in the first three games with these two teams involved I would say that the Lakers are gonna win you know the Lakers are gonna win this first round they're gonna advance to the next round and Phoenix Suns they did a good job of holding it down for as long as they could but 
it looks like the better team is going to win and that is the los angeles lakers that's my opinion that's what i think that's what i believe that's what i see is going to happen and you know devin booker got ejected at the towards the end i think the last minute of the game which was not good for the phoenix suns because they need that guy they need that guy to play his best and yeah Chris Paul, once again, the same thing that's been happening to Chris Paul for years now is that he gets injured in the playoffs, and it's one of the reasons why he can't get he can't get out of that hump. I don't know what it is. Chris Paul is, you know, we've been knowing this guy to make the playoffs with the Clippers, with the Hornets, you know, when he was first coming into the league, and he just can't get over that first round hump. Uh, he always gets injured when, you know, the guys start playing rough, and you know, I don't know what it is. I don't know if he has to live, hit the gym. No offense to Chris Paul because he does bring a lot to the table. He's a great player, great athlete, great point guard, great leader, and an all-star in my opinion. I think he should have been a part of the Lakers and we could have been winning some rings, but he went to Phoenix, joined uh, Devin Booker, and an amazing job what these guys were able to do as they came together. Uh, like I said, they ended up being the number two seed in the West, which is really tough right now. I think this team can only get better, but I do wish Chris Paul would join a team like the Lakers who have more star power, more veteran power, and a better chance to win the championship. But yeah, that's my opinions right now about the Lakers and Phoenix Suns. I think the Lakers are going to win the first round, and Phoenix is going to be out very soon, just based on what I've seen. And yeah, that's my opinion. As always, it's your boy Ricky Rick. If I'm not making you laugh, I'm not making you smile, I'm not keeping you entertained. Your boy Ricky Rick ain't doing his job. And I'm going to keep this video very short because I have more things I got to talk about, more things I got to upload. And until next time, your boy is out. Don't forget to like the video and support. And comment below, who do you think is going to win? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe we'll be back talking about another video. Even if Phoenix does win another game, I still think the Lakers are going to win this round and advance to the second round.